Well, 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 if it isn't the big tough guy from Dundee, the fighting man from Dundee, fucking disgrace, trying to say you're a fighting man. You barely even train, you've had one fight, you got decimated in seconds, and you're making all these excuses up. Now you're jumping on YouTube again and saying Dean Lynch Ward isn't a fighting man. Now let's get things straight. I do not like or support Dean Lynch Ward. But the man at least can fight a bit. You have no fucking right, you little scraghead cunt. And I can say this to you because I used to be a head an addict. I did. And you know, I, I, I spent years in it on Xanax, Valium, all sorts. And I used to do a bit of boxing when I was younger, but I would never disrespect other fighting men and boxers and try and say I am a fighting man. Because you need to put in the training, you need to fight and put hours and hours on end, not run up a couple of hills and hit a bag with terrible form for a couple of minutes. Doesn't make you a fighting man. Now, Bobby. I would happily come down to Dundee and have a fight with you. Or we'll stream it on your channel. I don't even have a channel. Stream it on your channel and you'll get views. But I am willing to bet my life on it that I will punch you silly and chuck you about like an empty fucking tracksuit like you are. Stop saying you're a fighting man. Stop saying other people aren't fighting men because you aren't. You're the furthest from a fighting man. There is. You're built like the side of a crinkled five pound note. You're an absolute idiotic baghead. And stop making out like you're supporting Danny Christie after he took you under his wing and dispersed some valuable law and knowledge. Because that guy is an amazing boxer and uh, he's going to go far at Wembley. And you know, we, we, we love Danny Christie up here. But you're now trying to make out that you're some, you're poly with him. You fucking blabbed about the guy after he helped you. You spoke personal about him. He was about your pal for one day.